Hello and welcome to me and my golf TV. We are your coaches Andy and Pierce, and you've joined us here on the beautiful par 3 18th at the Asbury in Shropshire, England for this week's 1560 where we answer your questions in just 60 seconds. It sure is. It's Friday so obviously you need to get those questions posted down below so we can pick one for next week. Definitely and loads of great questions coming in. We've got one here from Nico Claus actually on a, on a video that we did last week Pierce mm -hmm. talking about the driver basics and it was all about really the arc of the backswing and how what the club does as it moves around the body yep. and he says how much is the correct amount of arc as we swing the club around the body depending on what club we're using. It's a fantastic question because um, we're often talking about this and often people don't understand what the club should be doing yeah. and I think what we're going to talk about today really helps, it's going to help these guys at home really understand isn't it? Yeah I think you've got to bear in mind that there are all weird and wonderful kinds of backswings out there, you know your Jim Furyk's and your Ryan Palmer's and so we, we're not saying that there's one only one way to swing a golf club but when if someone is looking for a um, a basics, a point where to start from, so looking for good fundamentals, then the drill that we're going to give you or the concept we're going to give you actually works really well to help you with that. Definitely, it's a framework to build around, isn't good it? Good framework, really? absolutely. Okay, so 60 seconds, Pierce, to talk about uh, what Nico's asked. Okay. You ready to go? I'm ready to go. Okay, go. Okay, so first thing we do with people in this drill is called five point parallel. So we have an alignment stick on the ground which is running along to our target line. You can put it anywhere here as long as it's parallel to your target line. Now, what we're saying is with a lot of people's goal swings, there are five times when the club shaft, one, two, three, four, and five, could be parallel to the ground. Now, what we're saying is, to get this good framework, to get this good basics uh, in, a, in a goal swing, is if it's parallel to the ground, let's make it parallel to the target line. So. Parallel point one, club shaft parallel to the ground and parallel to the target line. Parallel point two, parallel to the ground, parallel to the target line. Three, which is the most important one there, four, and then five. And this is a fantastic drill just to rehearse, just to get that good feeling. And 52 seconds there. 52 please. seconds, I've got to hit this golf ball in six seconds from 200 now. 200 yards off the back tee oh, here, here we the go. Asbury. Oh, it's going to have to go a little bit. It's a bit out the toe. A little off the it's toe. It's only going to make the front edge, I think. We might have a splash. Oh, it's in the water. Oh, no. It's okay. In the water. Maybe, so it's great for accuracy, but not very good for contact, <laughs> apparently. <laughs> that was a bit, bit of a bad strike there. But yeah, really, really good for getting that good framework there. Maybe I was rushing a little bit of, of getting that... This, this, these basics that we're after. Yeah, definitely. I think if you can start from that, like you said, that's hopefully answered your question there, Nico, but I think it's a real good one to rehearse. Get something down on your target line so you know when that club is parallel to that target line and it's parallel to the ground. Okay, guys, hope that helps. Make sure you post your questions and comments for next week, and we'll see you then. So if you want to see more videos like this every single week, hit the subscribe button. Also follow us on Facebook, Instagram, Snapchat, and Twitter. Yes, and don't forget to check out our website, meandmygolf.com. Click the link in the corner there. Loads of great content that's going to help you take charge of your game. Thanks, guys.